Is he taking drugs right now? Yeah, he'll do some good. Shut the fuck up. I hate him. I hate him so fucking much. I gather you were close with Bertie. He tried to be a poet. Kept showing me his work and said all the other guys were too stupid to understand. I never told him how bad it was. He was a good kid. I took him into the group when he lost his father in a dark zone. He was ten years old. That's pretty young. Too young. But he had no one else. So I took him in. If you manage to take out those bandits, it... Jack Cock and Joe Cunt. <laughs> you think Cock and Cunt will change something? Death usually changes a lot in a person's life. Carl was wrong. We should have gone after them right away. But right or wrong, we have to help him. He's one of us. We'll rescue him and retrieve the crystals from Jack and Joe. Besides, I will Jack and Joe went up the hill to get a pail of water. Ralph, Susie, Logan, Birdie, they... <laughs> Go see Alberto. He can fix stuff like that on the spot. Thanks. I'm assuming our radio's broken. I tore here. Make sure no one sees you. You two make a pretty pair, Aiden. I'm on the roof nearby. We have to talk. Now. It's about saving your life. Wait, what? I'll tear them apart. I swear. I'll gut them. Real slow. Oh, over here. Okay. Peace. Is it safe? Peace. Oh Jesus, I'm not making it! How'd you make it? So should I just kill myself? Ay 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 boss. I don't care. Respawn. I don't need a call for help. I already have my help. I don't need anyone else but you, honey. Oh my god, there's howlers everywhere and I'm just trying to find a safe way to get off this roof. Jesus. Well, Ader, what's gonna save my life? What do you want? I don't like what's going on here, Aiden. First Jack and Joe's bandits killed Carl's people. Now Sophie's getting ready to retaliate. You're not a part of that, are you? You said you wanted me to get close to them. I'm gonna search Sophie's camp. That's why I came to warn you. Rumors have started. You found the Lazarus for me. They may suspect you of being a PK spy. Oh my god, what am I gonna do? You came here just to warn me? You helped me with the Lazarus. And I take care of my allies. Sophie's just fighting for water, that's all. I don't think she suspects anything. <laughs> you think so? She hates the peacekeepers. She blames us for not helping the bazaar. And for her mother's death. So when we start questioning her people, you better be careful. Thanks for the warning. You gain any intel for our investigation? Sophie's also wondering who killed Lucas. What else would she say? They know if we can prove they killed Lucas, it'll be a bloodbath. Find out from Sophie when she's planning the attack. Keep me informed where you are. Be careful. Oh God. Yeah, I'm not. I'm not a big fan. You see that 
That fucking zombie on the roof over there doing a Take dance? Should we go fuck with it? Wanna try fucking with it? I kinda wanna try fucking with it. He's interesting. Actually, yeah. What weapon do I want equipped? Hold on. I need to give I need to put something onto this. Oh, I can't mod the stinky pipe. What is this? Sorry, Han. I was... Ah! Wait! Oh, God. I was at full health! Hold on, I'm putting myself at full health. Ish. I'm right here. Might as well. I don't know how this is gonna go. Oh, okay, GRE anomaly. Thanks. Thanks. Ah, oh, Jesus, I fell. I can't see. Did he, did he run away? Oh, no, he's over there. Jesus. We were too far away. Where is he? It hit morning. Oh man, that's okay. At least we didn't like get fucked over or anything. And then we get what's inside here. I'm sure there's other stuff in there too. Yeah. Okay, we can try it next time. Let's just get back to Sophie. Like, how more cons like it like conspicuous can you get than being like two rooftops away? Like, I don't understand. Oh my god! Why am I dodging? I'm telling you to go up. Jesus. I I cannot jump the length I need to jump apparently. What the Fuck this goddamn fucking controller! Oh my god. It looks like Sophie's not here. I better look for her. No, we gotta look for Sophie. Well, that's useless. How many f go down? Jesus! Aren't you stressed out over what Sophie will do next? Okay, who are we talking to? Have you seen Sophie? Sophie? Uh, she went that way. 
Thanks. Wait! There's more. One more thing. Something's wrong with the... Dad's asking if there's something wrong with your radio. Oh, uh, it hisses sometimes, but as long as it works, no point messing with it. Um, can I ask you a question? Sure. Call me Aiden. Vincenzo. Uh, Aiden? How do you become a pilgrim? Does that mean you're a murderer? Vincenzo! Why? Dad, I'm asking because I'm curious. Will you tell me, Aiden? I'm not that exciting. I've had to kill people, but I'm not a murderer. All being a pilgrim is to me now is a means to an end. To what end? Vincenzo, leave him alone! To find the only family I've ever known. Did you? Not yet, but I might be close. I hope you succeed. I've never found Federico. Who? Federico. He was my best friend. He disappeared like the other kids because of the... Tests? You mean Jesus? You heard that when they built the walls, they were trying to create a vaccine here? It all fell apart in a couple of weeks. One day, Federico vanished into thin air. We'd been playing football. I went to my house after that. He went home too. I'm sure they took him. You see, he wasn't the only child who went. I hope he's alive. And that you find him someday. There's only so much I care about for that. Okay. Hey you, Dry County. Let's get wasted. The fuck? Dumb bitch. How's your radio? Working now? Sometimes it works. Sometimes. Susie, Logan. I swear I'll tear them apart and eat the pieces. Bertie. What now? Do you remember the beginning of the fall, Aiden? <laughs> Vaguely. I remember it as if it were yesterday. We'd been to. She was losing dozens of people every day. She was. Eventually. She was injured. It was dawn. They led me to her and made me promise to look after my brother. <laughs> she said it as if she was lending me a car and asking me to have it returned intact. After that, she appointed Carl as her successor, with me at his side. You'll grow up to be a far better leader than Carl, she said. But while the world is burning, people won't listen to someone so young. She was wrong. I've been thinking like that all my life. But not anymore. Now I understand my mother. You have to be ruthless to be a leader. I wasn't ready then. I am now. I think I know what you're talking about. And I know what loss is like. Talking about someone in particular? <laughs> about my sister. I'm sorry. Yeah, maybe you don't have to be. We'll find out. That's why you came to town. For her. Yeah. Sophie, we have to talk. Time to act. The quicker we do this, the less prepared Jack and Joe will be. Aiden. Aiden. He's gonna push us off the roof. And we started on the wrong foot. A sip of courage. Should you be drinking this much before the mission, Barney? Me? <laughs> Where's Sophie? There. On the rooftop. I'm watching you, Pilgrim. <laughs> Always watched. Whoa! Did you see that? Oh my god, I'm saving that. 